upgrade and you get the horse the same year. Yeah. Winner. Yeah. Well, there's been point with uh, Britney Spears did that. A lot of uh, celebrities ended up doing that. Well, that's very in when you're yeah. famous. What was that guy? Jason Alexander she was married to. Not the guy yeah. from uh, <laughs> <laughs> Seinfeld. I, know. I was like, wait Some a second. Random oh, yeah. guy, yeah. You didn't know she married that guy? Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm weird about spinning. <laughs> oh. oh, no. afford to own your own home, you don't believe in that rubbish. I don't believe in that rubbish. You know what I believe in? You. I believe that you, with the help of Home Buyer Centre, can get that first home happening for about the same as you're paying in rent. What have you got to lose? You're a loan-getting, land-finding, home-building winner. So don't be a renter. Call Home Buyer Centre on 131751 today and own it. Saturday nights. During July, you could win a private party for you and 77 friends, valued at $10,000. To see it in the hole. Hmm. I mean, as we noted, the president, understandably, rightly, got the very best possible medical care. He is the president of the United States. Do we know how much of a role that plays in someone being able to recover? Uh, we don't really know in his case. Most of the medical treatments he received are widely used and widely available, with the main exception of an experimental antibody treatment that seems promising, but you know, it's impossible to say whether that actually helped the president in this circumstance. And Dr. Lena Wen, an emergency physician and public health professor at George Washington University, said, remember, the president isn't fully over his illness. Based on the White House's own timeline, the president is, as of today, on day six of his illness. Days 7 through 10 are when we could potentially experience another deterioration in his condition. And so he is not out of the woods yet. And in fact, I hope that his doctors are keeping an extremely close eye on his condition. Uh, one more thing to ask you about in the minute or so we have left, Richard, which is the FDA, the Food and Drug... Dude, today's fucked. Why is she going as fast as we're going is a better question is why is she going 55 going the wrong way? Where is she going to go? Yeah, she has nowhere 
And she's gonna have she's gonna get all the way to the bridge and have nowhere to go. Get the, we can pass this guy. Get the fuck on the way. Oh my god. What are you doing, bro? Oh my Get god. Get off the fucking We're gonna have to wait and find out in the Supreme Court, and basically the ball is in their court to see whether they take this back up. And it's interesting to note, um, one reporter was playing out right now is, is basically a, a legal warfare. You're seeing this play out in Pennsylvania. You have now the Trump campaign going to the U.S. Supreme Court. And we're what just the seeing fuck? Now. This is a new uh, filing from the Trump campaign. Um, But that's alright. Hush.